Welcome back to Get Down to Business, the show all about small business, jobs, and entrepreneurship. I'm thrilled to be joined by Frank Devine, the CEO of Accelerated Improvement Limited. And he has written a fantastic read, which I've been enjoying. It's called Rapid Mass Engagement, Driving Continuous Improvement Through Employee Culture Creation. Frank, welcome to the program. Uh, Thank you, Sean. It's an honor to have you. So let's talk about um, what you do and why you're so passionate about doing it. Can you uh, give us a little bit of a glimpse behind the microphone of how you got started in this line of work? Yeah, well, I spent many years in corporate life trying to make uh, top-down culture change work. Um, and I got uh, eventually I got fed up with banging my head against a brick wall uh, and decided we needed a better way of doing this. And the book is a, the result of 40 years of experimentation. Well, uh, that, that's fantastic. And, and you, you, you highlight so many things that have been implemented successfully at brands such as Rolls-Royce, Coca-Cola, Boston Scientific, and Johnson & Johnson, which is fantastic. So there's a couple of premises that you have um, in the book, which I want to make sure we're highlighting, including for our small business owners regarding improving right. key metrics, delivering organizational breakthroughs, and increasing social mobility. We can't pack too much into our short conversation. What are some of the highlights that you think an entrepreneur listening to this program needs to know. Yeah, well, the first thing is the size of business is not an obstacle to doing this. In fact, um, the smaller the business, the more intimate the um, relationships and the connections you can create, and it's actually an advantage. So um, somebody um, starting out with a relatively small business, et cetera, should not be um, awed by, you know, the big names like the Coca-Cola, et cetera. It's actually more difficult for the big organizations than for the small ones. And in terms of making a social difference, um, the driving force behind this is is very personal. I, I, um, I had to leave my own country, Ireland, um, at the age of 18, and my mother was a single mother, so she lost her whole family, in a sense, to emigration. And I want um, fewer mothers, if you like, to um, have that experience, so to keep more jobs um, and create jobs in deprived areas in particular is a driving force for me. Mm -hmm, Absolutely. Again, I'm chatting with Frank Devine, founder of Accelerated Improvement Limited, uh, which specializes in creating a high performance, continuous improvement culture from the bottom up. And that's the key word, the bottom up Um, in your book, which I hesitate to even call it a book because really it's a guide. Um, You talk about how employees create and own their own high performance culture. And I really appreciate what you just said, Frank, that it's not about the size of the business. Anybody can do this. So let's talk practically. I love to give people homework assignments. What can a small business owner do to create that culture within their organization? Well, the the first thing I I would say is to recognize that um, your employees, however however big or small you are, your your employees have discretion over how much they give to the organization. And in effect, everybody who employs people is competing with their families, with their social life, with their sports interests, whatever it might be. So we have to think of it as uh, we've got to make it worthwhile for people to come to work. So they want to come to work. They enjoy coming to work and they grow and develop as people by coming to work and being part of success, if you like. So I think that's the first mindset that we are in competition for the attention of our own employees. And we have to try and win that competition, not at the expense of people's families and interests, but in a way that um, enhances all of that experience. Fantastic. And uh, I know you use the term RME, which also happens to be connected to the title of the book, but um, yeah, rapid, rapid mass engagement. Yeah. What, yeah. what should, what should uh, our listeners uh, expect when they pick up a copy of rapid mass engagement? What are some of the, what are some of the highlights um, without sharing any of the secrets in our, in our short interview today? Um, well, I suppose the, um, the biggest single thing is culture change is, available much quicker than conventional um, approaches uh, uh, say, you know, if you do the right things and you do them quickly enough and you do them with the right integrity and determination, it's amazing how quickly um, the culture can change. I talk in the book of um, the idea of bow wave, the bow wave effect. So sometimes when you throw a pebble into the, into a lake, the actual waves uh, wash up on the other side of the of the shore, and there's so many things um, individual leaders can do, but, but more importantly, 
collectively leaders and employees working together can do. And by the way, trade unions are not a, an obstacle here. They're just a, a complication um, to create those kind of bow waves and change the culture pretty rapidly. Now, it does take longer to sustain it and keep it going through generations of new leaders and all that. But you can change the culture much quicker than people think. And that's, what the rapid, that's what the rapid means. The mass means all employees, not, not, a, not a selection of them. And the engagement is about getting to people at emotional levels, which we don't normally get to in business. All three of those acronyms, Mio, all, all three of those letters in the acronym, rapid mass engagement, it means a lot yeah. and there's meaning behind it. And I know that's what folks can uh, look forward to in rapid mass engagement when they pick it up. So Frank, I really enjoyed our conversation. I look forward to having you back on real soon. But uh, uh, for now, how can we get in touch with you, your team, and of course, well, the, 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 the Accelerated Improvement website uh, is available. Obviously, I'm on LinkedIn. Um, there's a lot going on in relation to the book on LinkedIn and elsewhere. So um, they're probably the easiest ways. Do you want my email address? <laughs> uh, well, we'll link through, um, through our show notes. Frank Devine from Hi. Rapid Mass Engagement. Um, absolutely appreciate you. Um, I know you're, you're very responsive, and we'll make sure that everybody can get in touch with you. And, of course, pick up a copy of the book on Amazon. Rapid mass engagement, all really important calls to action over here. Frank Devine, thanks so much for sharing your expertise with Thank our you, listeners. Sir. We'll Thank be right back. Much. Pleasure. Bye-bye.